Welcome to Best Laid Plans. Today we're doing a bonus business plan video. Hi, I'm Janae and I teach productivity that sticks. If you're interested in planning your perfect life, be sure to subscribe so you don't miss a thing. This is where my monthly video plan goes. And that's where these go. You can have them all sparkly and stuff. And this is a Monday start. Perfect. See, this is why I need to have the Monday. On this one, I cover up the numbers. But my menu plan, I don't. So, yeah, I gotta remember that next time. Alright, so now this is where I plan on these being posted. <laughs> don't have room. The releases is taking up the slot. These guys need to be just a little shorter so I can fit two in the box. And of course more vlogs if I can, but I think I'm going to try to just do a weekly. What channel it goes on, I'm not sure whether we're going to keep it on Best Laid Plans channel. Possibly. And I think if I go into extended cleaning or stuff like that, I can put that on a different channel. But Kind of like how I'm doing it now, where we're just keeping track of the goals and the challenges. I plan to film everything and try to have everything prepped two weeks in advance. You know what? We need some dopamine here. Let's check this off. I've filmed Challenge Chat. I've filmed the Tuesday morning time management tip. And I've got plenty of vlog filmed. And I need to work on these. All right, so yep, we're doing good this week. These actually need to go ahead into my current week process. Okay. So there is the video plan. And, and I have video checklists that I put in here too. Okay, now this one is actually my social media page. Social media, and I still haven't um, cut that down to fit. This is a Sunday start, darn. So the whole thing needs to be fixed. So I don't even have a fancy header for it. It's a reminder of the ideal days to do these things on. And I need a vertical convert. It was a miscut, but that's all right. I have extra numbers on the matrix. Wasn't sure how this was going to work out, so I only did a couple weeks at a time, but I quite like how this is set up. And I just discovered a problem. We're not using this as a monthly. This is part of my weekly planner, basically. So if I was smart, I put this on removable paper. Where will this fit? I think I can just cut this down. Definitely need to fix that. All right. Now numbers. Yippee. I'm a little heavy-handed with this stuff, aren't I? <laughs> I keep grabbing two numbers. They're just so tiny. Alright, we have five weeks represented with a Monday start. And then room for notes as to what I posted and to make sure that I get it everywhere. <laughs> so you have my social media plan, which I know isn't much to look at. And then this is the things that need to be done specifically on those days. And then the, yeah, the YouTube plan. And then this one, another business plan bonus. Never been seen before. This is a toughie. Trying to keep everything scheduled ahead of time. When my subscription box come out, like the January subscription box actually has March stickers in it and then I've got things I need to do for February's box which is April stickers and then March's box which is May stickers it just gets really confusing so if I put it all here onto a calendar it makes it a little easier to keep track February March April and these are May let's use a actually use the tripless pen here these would actually be March see now this just doesn't go with that. I'm gonna end up using <laughs> the green because it looks better. 
these are always so slightly different. And I'm assuming that this is also not going to fit there properly. See, in December, they fit perfectly. This month, not so much. Of course, I laid that down crooked. It's like a thing, you know. Just make everything crooked. Why not? And that's May. And then this would end up being June. All right. So what have we got here? This one I definitely need. We need the numbers. This is a weekly checklist. And then if I have anything backed up from the month before, I just kind of stack these up. But these are deadlines. These are the things that they need to be done by. But that's why I have a checkbox on them. So if I do them early, some things can be done early, some things can't. The things that can be done early, I can check it off. <laughs> it's obviously a subscription cutoff date. That's not really something that I do. It's just something I need to know. Okay, so and now I start putting in all of these little monthly bits. This gets really confusing. I have a cheat sheet to use, and it's still, I don't know, still hard. <laughs> feel silly saying it all the time, but yes, all of these stickers I use are out of my own shop. Shop.bestlaidplans.vip, link is in the description. Okay, um, obviously these aren't available because these are just specialized stickers, but if you're running a subscription box or designing stickers, they might be helpful. Um, again, I run an Amazon business as well, so it's all kind of thrown in here. And I just add this in just in case somebody might be interested. I don't know. And there, oof, yeah, between those three pages, we have a business plan that doesn't count the weekly business plans, which go here. <laughs> and sometimes I can plan those in advance because this I don't put any decorative stickers on. A lot of the times I will plan the week in advance. And so I may do that. I'm not sure, but that will be my weekly plan with me. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope this was helpful and I will see you on the next Best Laid Plants. I literally have a page with just a 14 and a 15 on it.